Another drive-through, I want to call this the fight between what was, what is, and what will be. And the reason I want to chat about this, I was in a meeting the other day and it ran for about four hours and it was a discussion about how this particular company had built over about 50 years one heck of a brand. Uh, at least that was true up until about five or six years ago. And they were well known, established, knocked the ball out of the park, leader in their industry. And a lot of what was being done now was kind of looking back at that and kind of riding those coattails. In fact, we came to the conclusion in the next five to seven years, this organization will probably be out of business unless they dramatically do something now. So kind of what was, they were kind of riding that, but they were gonna ride it into the ground. Uh, the last five or six years is the performance has been not only incredibly mediocre financially, but from a point of view of customers is uh, making a lot of good customers angry. Some of these customers are hard to keep happy, but the uh, focus was to work with the easiest customers as opposed to how can we get really good to deal with these difficult customers. So as their customer base, as they've started having more turnover in the organization, what is happening right now is not good at all. Uh, they still have a reputation, they still look good. Uh, there's kind of a core people have been there for many, many years, but they can't attract and keep people that are the new generation, the millennials. So it's very interesting because what was, I think is fuzzing up what is, and unless we do something about the what is, what will be uh, is a disaster. So I think as you look at your organization, I think looking at back at many years of history is great. Uh, but to be honest, the last 50 years, I, I wonder if the last 48, 49 really matter. So make sure you're looking not just at what was, but spending a lot of time on what is, but what is happening now that will create what you're going to be. Thank you for your time.